maybe do a little fishing, but it's been blowing and blowing and blowing and blowing and blowing and blowing. Needless to say, it's been kind of windy too. So last trip, we went out and got our stone crab traps, brought them in, and uh, they were all out of bait. But then I, I was going out fishing after we pulled the traps, so I just tied them all off and zip tied them and dropped them back in the water here and uh, until I had some bait to put in them. So I've got some bait. It's getting good and rotten in the cooler, packed on ice. So we need to get that out of the cooler and uh, then we're going to see what we can get into out there, if we can get out there. It's, it's kind of windy. It was calling for 1.3s, but I don't know. We'll see once we get out there. This is crazy, guys. Look at the nice blue crabs we got in here. And a stone crab. We had no bait in here. None. Female. Let her go. Yeah, I know. I know. Nope, it's a male. So that's a male. We'll keep him. What are you laughing at? Guys, I have taught her very well. Take the L. Take the L. That's nice. All right, dude. You gotta let go, man. I'm gonna put you in the water. You gotta let go. You gotta let go. Check this guy. Got him by the back. All right. As hard as you can. Don't mess around. No, you grab his claws, honey. Grab it. There you go. He's a shooter. We gotta measure him quick. Ow. Open him all the way up. I know you gotta open him all the way up. Move your finger out the way. Just fairly short. Okay, throw him back. Good job, kiddo. All right, we're gonna run the ground here. Put all those ropes inside, honey. It's funny because we get a bunch of crab traps here. People probably think, oh, that must be a really good spot. <laughs> we just threw them here to get them off the boat till we had bait. Man, look at how nasty it is. It's been so windy just sediment and stuff all over these ropes okay this is crazy they're all probably shorts he's not dead he's probably getting ready to molt this one just molted too that's what you just threw away that wasn't a dead crab feel him the one that you thought was dead that's her molt See that? So this is a sh soft shell, guys. So they're molting. He, 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 it won't matter, he's soft, he can't hurt me. So we're gonna be gentle with that guy. Ellie thought that her, his molt was, uh, was a dead crab. It molted in there. So that one you don't wanna get poked by. That one might keep. That's crazy. I wasn't expecting to find anything in them. This is nuts. Open that up, Elle. Guys, we didn't have a lick of bait in here. And look at this. Look at this female. Full of eggs. We're going to let you go, Mama. We'll make babies. We'll eat them. Yeah, we'll eat them. And then we'll eat oh, we'll be back for her claws. Let's see. This guy's just... This is a short, quite a short. We definitely got some stone crab claw right there. That big one. That might be a keeper. 
All right, this guy's got a claw or two we can take. There we go. All right, grab the knife up there, baby. Go ahead and stick it right in there. Now just wiggle it back and forth nice and easy. There, finally. All right. There's dinner. That and the blue crab. Woo! Oh, wait. I'm not putting them in there. That's... <sighs> Steak. Okay, slide all that slime down, there you go, and then just grab that loop, and I will cut the, uh, the zip tie off. Look at all of the nastiness. That's what happens, guys, when it's blowing 20 miles an hour for a month straight. You get all that sediment. See, I just zip tied all my extra rope here. Ellie, why did I do that? Uh, so that the buoy didn't float away. Or right because what would happen a boat get it caught in their prop and that would make somebody very upset there you go kiddo are you kidding me there's more in here too good one nice blue Huge blue crab. Male or a female? Male, yes! Look at the sun crab in there, Dad. Watch your hand. <laughs> What's up, fella? Stop fighting, guys. Uh oh, that blue crab is nasty. Don't be a rat. Alright, that one's gotta keep. Alright, got him. That's a nice little blue crab there. Hi, sir. Get some meat off of you. Alright. You know how you can also tell a lot of times is the red females tip. have the red tips. See this? Well, I just wired a new pump, wash down pump in, and it was hard to get to. It's, it's all the way in the back corner up underneath, and I've got a hole to work through about that big, and it's right at the end of my reach. But, I got it done, and it's nice to have that. Three footers. Let me set these long ones. I know I got way too much line for out here. So I'll see how far, how much rope I got hanging. And if I have to, I can just zip tie a couple loops in it so it's not drifting away back. Yeah, that ain't too bad. Now those have weights on them too, so that'll keep that buoy upright. All right, guys, well, got them all set. Got a few uh, a few crab claws and a couple blue crabs. Got three nice blue crabs, and so I don't know. Maybe we, uh, maybe we go home and make something cool. Haven't figured out what yet. All right, guys, we're going to get out of this wind. Stop beating up the cat. Get him, Webster, get him. Welcome back to the kitchen. Yup, we are doing a boil. How about that? This recipe calls for smoked sausage. I didn't have any smoked, but I do have hot Italian. I'm gonna start cooking those and browning them a little bit. Check that out, man. What is going on there? 
Wow, he cut his off and mine's growing. All we're gonna do is cut those bad boys in half. All right, potatoes, I'm gonna quarter these just so they don't take forever to cook. What's up, T? Nope, you can't have none. We got ponytails in here, guys, so you can see, but can you see better? Yes, oh, hey, high five, buddy. Now I gotta wash my hands. You can use white. I prefer red, or in this household, we call them purple. So if you're on my team, that's a purple onion, give me a shout out in the comment section. My mom was the cook in our family. You know, she learned from her mom and then from my dad's mom, she actually learned a bunch of cool recipes and well, she was very good at it. This stuff here, I'm just gonna chop this up lightly. And garnish with that. I need that white wine. I need two cups of white wine. I was gonna say, if you could get that out of there, go ahead. There is no little thing. Oh yeah. Two cups. I hope we got two cups. Thank you. All right, close enough. I need uh, one cup of water. We don't use wine too often in this house, so only use it for making sauces and stuff. All right, we're gonna need these. Why don't you go dump those in there while I get the garlic going. So one cup of water, two cups of white wine. Cut them in half like that. All right, go throw that in the pot, sweetheart. Oh, I love me some garlic. And then throw that one in there. Actually, this is thyme, guys. We're gonna throw the thyme in there too. There you go. You got the onions and the lemons. That needs to go in. And then here, dump that in there too. We don't need that much. That's enough. These are hot Italian, which will be perfect. Slice them up. Like that. So we let this go for, I don't know, 15 minutes. Got it boiling, and then we just turned it down. Now we're gonna throw some butter in there. Three, four ounces, and we're gonna add our potatoes and corn and our sausage whoop got some runaways is it just one yes Man, i have been cooking all day and working on the boat cleaning fish look at this i made this for lunch i gotta add some more water to it Chicken soup. Did you try any of that yet, Ben? Nope, yet. Look at this bone broth. It is good. Very good. All right, guys, so I'm gonna put this on medium heat. We're gonna let it go for like 15 to 20 minutes with the lid on. And then we can add our crabs and shrimp. Holy cow, that's good. All right, so now we're gonna add our crabs. These guys are deceased, so what I did is I shoved them in the freezer for a little while, and that just kind of turns them off, you know, so that they're, they're not going in there alive. We always put them in alive, but I know that uh, some people don't agree with that, and I kind of get it, so let's do this.
<laughs> yeah, baby. Oh, yeah. All right. Now we're going to bring them back to a boil, and we're going to set this for eight minutes. See you in eight minutes, or it'll be now. Which one he goes for? You gotta put them in two different hands. Oh, oh you can do that. Put them on two different sides of the floor and see which one he goes for. Oh. <laughs> you probably that. can't see either of them. His man bun is coming out. Come here, show everybody your man bun that's falling out. T, come here. Come here. Hi, baby. Hi. Oh my goodness. I feel like we need a little sunglasses for him. Yeah, sunglasses, Mom says. And we're going to throw a little bit more seasoning over the top of this stuff. Oh yeah. I don't think I can handle that. I've seen you. I've seen you. You can handle it. I can handle it. What about you? Yeah. How cool is it there? I mean, we didn't catch a lot of crabs, or we had a lot of crabs, but we didn't catch a ton of keepers, but come on. No bait. We were just storing them there till we could get back out and bait them and move them to our spot. catch. Isn't it good? Yeah. So good. Here you go, mama. Ellie was here. She did all the work. Look at the meat right there. All right, guys. Well, we're going to proceed to eat this entire pot. And uh, that was just our taste test. We just want to thank you guys so much. It's going on two years uh, since we started the channel. We owe everything to you guys, and we're very thankful. God bless you, and I guess we're going to see you guys in the next one because we are out of here.